Um, we also recognize in terms of T20 cricket that we, we need a way to find our next crop of T20 players, right? We, we, we have had success um, in T20 cricket and I'm sure that the head coach is anticipating some more success you know, as we play at home in this in this World Cup, um, but we, we we generally still have to work hard at at finding our next crop of um, emerging T20 stars, and um, there is some recognition that it, that the CPL may not necessarily be um, where those stars would 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 at least where they would emerge. Um, so we are working with CPL to have an emerging players regional T20 tournament um, that we are trying to we are trying to have in May of, of next year. Um, so that is something that that we can look forward to as well. We are still working through the the actual format of the tournament with with um, CPL. Obviously you would know that we would need the permission of CPL um, who have um, you know very willingly come forward um, recognizing that we do need that 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 aspect of um, development in our T20 pool. Um, obviously, they know that it, it would have positive repercussions um, for them as well in terms of um, their product. Um, so we are we are still walking through the details. What what I can tell you that it would definitely be um, regional players only um, whether whether there is any limitations on age, um, that is one of the things that we are considering to ensure that, that it serves the purpose that we want to serve in terms of um, being that forum for uh, the emerging players to come through. Um, but what we, have, what we have identified is that we will definitely play that tournament in the, in the May window post-West Indies Championship.